We are digging deeper into this case and the sex crime charges facing that property owner, Michael Hendricks. 4119 reporter Kat Reed spent the day going through several court documents. That's right, and Kat, we understand you've learned more about Hendricks' girlfriend who's facing similar charges. That's right, Caitlin, and these are very disturbing allegations against them. Maggie Barr and Michael Hendricks are facing numerous charges, including child enticement, child molestation, and sexual misconduct. Those stem from an incident that allegedly took place in late 2020 or early 2021. According to a probable cause statement, it involved a child who said Maggie Ibarra is her mother. Before we share some details from that court document, a warning to sexual assault survivors, this could be triggering. According to this probable cause statement, the child told investigators that Maggie Ibarra, her mom, had her try on lingerie. Then all three parties, the child, Ibarra, and Michael Hendricks were in bed together. That's when the child alleged Hendricks started touching her and he moved his hand lower, rubbing her private area over underwear. The child said her mom was also rubbing her hands and that the two adults had sexual contact with her in the bed. On that same day, the child said Ibarra and Hendricks showed her pictures of a girl and told her they killed the girl, that Hendricks choked her to death and put her in the freezer. The child said they showed her pictures of the body and it was cut up. Later on in the visit, the child said Hendricks and Ibarra told her they wanted a sexual relationship with her, something the child says she knew was wrong. Now, Ibarra is also accused of asking Hendricks to, to dispose of evidence and of pressuring the young girl to recant her statement about what happened. An attorney for Hendricks says his client denies the allegations against him. And I left a message for Ibarra's attorney, but haven't heard back. For the I-Team, I'm Kat Reed, 41 Action News.